morning guys welcome to today's video today is all about I don't even know because today has not unfolded for me yet every day holds the possibility of a miracle and a surprise and who knows what's gonna happen today um, but I'm excited to find out so come and join me and let's go down and take care of our horses okay so that's the first thing that happened to me I literally went let this was on here and I literally went to get my coffee and this this fell right off so that's an interesting part of my day. So it's just Ruby and I this morning. It's gorgeous outside. Some of you guys would probably think it's like crazy colder than winter, but it's supposed to be. 12 degrees today just trying not to slip in the mud so we have half ice half snow half mud and it's still I mean it, the ground's not completely mushy yet because it's still freezing but anyway um, I woke up this morning everybody else is still asleep I left them because I can't sleep in and I do not want a grouchy Sam, Sophie, and Gabby today. It's been a long March break. We've been busy every single second, it seems like. And we haven't had much rest, much sleep. So I'm gonna try and go solo today and see what happens. Well, I'm locked out of the barns. Let me lock the door, you guys. Wait for the night. Stand here a while, take a little time Since you went away, you came to a halt Silence is everywhere, and you're not It's up there again. Come here, kitty. We brought him down last night. Don't jump on me. Come on. I don't know, I don't know how he's getting up there. Oh, you are annoying. Oh, Stella, you made a mess. You guys, Willow is not a treat aggressive pony. I know we made it look like that a couple of times because I showed you her acting crazy. I mean, it wasn't even that crazy. Um, she very rarely ever acts like that, but she does always act like that to Stella. I see her out the window jumping up and down and trying to kick Stella and snap at her. It has nothing to do with us because we're not even around. It has to do with the fact that she wants to be the head honcho right willow and she was at her old house at her old house she was the queen bee and she is and i always suspected she'd run stella and she is running stella it's hard for you guys not to assume that we give too many treats because i actually show us giving treats but um the amount of treats we give each day some days we don't give any and if you look back there's lots of footage of us hanging out with willow and not giving her treats so today Sam's going to try and get his tractor started and fix this arena so we can get our last thing in here. All right, door open. Open sesame. Oh, I got it, guys. Yeah, I'll be cleaning up the poop out here. It is gorgeous out. Um, the minute we can start working on another paddock for these girls, we will. I'm excited to do that too. One thing you guys might not know, especially if you're new to our channel, but once spring and summer hits, Canadian people never stay inside. I don't clean my house for the whole entire summer practically because we uh, try and get... Oh, 
These guys are just getting used to each other. Willow used to hate Ruby. Anyway, um, yeah, it's true. We spend all of our time outside and we still might keep our trailer, you guys. We might still keep our vacation trailer um, at the beach, even if it means we only go and spend some days there. Yeah, we might do it. But anyway, huh. I feel free and fresh and amazing. It's amazing what a nice, amazing, uh, uh, mild day can do for your spirit, even when there's mud everywhere. Wow, it's about time. Lazy bones. So are you. I checked on you before I came. No, I wasn't actually asleep. You were snoring. No, I, I saw you. Oh. When you went. Oh. Willow's like, get me out of this place. She won't let me go till I eat my grain. Clearly this horse is not too hungry because she wants to just go. Get up. Oh, Stella. Oh, Stella. Even though Willow tries to be the boss of Stella, she loves oh. Stella and looks to Stella. Stella's like always the boss because Willow will bite Stella, but then Stella does not care at all. Is it because we give her too many treats, Gabby? Come on. No, it's because it's supper time and Stella's like, I'm going and Willow's like, no. <gasps> Whoa, did you see that? that Stella took my poop. No, Stella took she was it a kick? Stella took my pep talk to heart yesterday. She's like, I'm not gonna put up with that. Oh look, she's just eating. I need to be more mindful of where I throw the hay. Yeah, Stella's lay, uh, staking claim. She goes to all of the hay. Today I can ride Stella and Stormy. Alright, well let's get ready. Framing with Stormy. Today I want to start something new. I want to start a trend. I want to encourage every single one of you guys to comment below a confession, a true confession. I want you to say, I confess, and then share something not perfect about yourself. Because when we share things that aren't perfect about ourselves, it helps us to be more real to other people and be more real to ourselves. It's very, very freeing. It helps you realize that you don't have to be perfect to be loved and you don't have to be perfect to be a good person and to be okay. You guys are you're all okay. Any mistakes that you make are yours to make, yours alone, and a part of your own private journey. Um, so I'm gonna start us off, and I'm gonna put this on Instagram too, but I wanna hear all your juicy confessions. So I confess that I often get sucked into the craze on YouTube, into the hate. I always tell myself every single morning when I wake up, Laura, relax, they're just comments, it's not a big deal. But before I know it, I'm sucked into people making assumptions about us and saying, you guys are doing this, even though it is so far from the truth, um, I need to just like be chill and be like, yeah, if that's what you wanna believe, then that's okay. And I understand because uh, you're not here, so you can't see what we do all the time. So uh, I confess that I suck at getting sucked into the comments and I wanna be different than that. I wanna just stand back and, and just be like, yeah, okay, I understand how you feel that way. Uh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't make any difference. Um, so now I want to hear what you guys confess. Let's go see if Gabby will confess something. It should probably take her a while. All right, Gabby, we're doing this thing on our channel today. It's called I Confess, and we have to share a confession about something that we don't do perfectly that we might think other people will judge us on, but it's okay to make your own mistakes. So what do you jump confess? Jump position, because mine's horrible. Your jump position is horrible? Say, I confess. I Butt back, but then no. Yeah, it's hard. But anyway, she's gonna be riding in her new saddle today, and maybe that will help, right? Yeah. Which last time I tried to frame Storm Bitless, which he does do that. Yeah. Um, yeah. Threw a little bit. He was like, oh, no! He even did that. I think I saw he it. Threw his head up. I think like, I saw nah. it. So one thing you guys don't know about Gabby is that she's. Plus, he was really mad. Since yeah, he wants to go, doesn't he? Oh, and then I almost fell off, but like it didn't look like that. So I was walking, and then at S right here on this side of the arena, not this side, this side. Not this side, you guys, this side. Okay, go ahead. No, this side. For okay, them sorry. And sorry. Side for oh, okay. Got so, it straight now. So the side for that. Okay, <laughs> <Hey, hey>, go. <laughs> at S formed it a huge horse shape. All of his body. Oh. Shook. While you were on him? Yeah. Did it feel cool? It feels like a bolt, kind of. A bolt, kind of? Because you just go like that and you have to hold on with your thighs to stay on. I confess that Gabby is usually super, super quiet, but some days. Did you have coffee? Yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, some days she never stops talking. This is an episode of I Confess. I want you to I Confess and then share something that um, that you, people don't know about you that makes you less than perfect. I confess that... I'm not a good poop monger. That's true. <laughs> but you're better at it than me. Hi guys, we are at the barn and we're with Storm. And what happened today in the field? He did not like his wrap. He didn't like his wrap, so you took it off, Storm. You gotta keep your wrap on, man. How are you gonna get better? So, we're gonna clean and rewrap it instead of tonight. We're gonna do it now. Kind of looks good, so it's not like yellowy. And that's it. We are done. We've rebanded Storm. We've changed his blanket because it's supposed to be nice and warm today, but maybe rain, so we got his raincoat on. And we're good. Unfortunately, we have a little bit of herd boundness going on here. Stella's gone. She's getting tacked up for a little lunge, hopefully. And Willow is not too happy about it. With a painted smile, I was the willow tree. You were the fire that burned me. Right till the end, we didn't know we lost. It's not. Okay. You're gonna ride without stirrups on her? No, I don't think so. Yeah. How clean her stall is. Stella, look at you. Um, do you want me to go find some stirrups? Sure, but she needs the leathers. Yeah, we have the leathers. So we are super lucky to have a big, huge flood zone now. Look at all the mud. A homemade stream there from the snow and then all mud. Because this farm is under construction at the moment and things are all getting changed and done and they were do it done in the winter, uh, everything's mud. Like there used to be grass here. Like imagine this with grass. Sam's still trying to get his tractor going and then there's a big stream here. Stella's fat again. We were told to give her an extra. I don't think this is safe either. Gabby, I don't think this is safe. We should just lunge in Oh my God, she's fat again. How did that happen? I don't even understand. I gave her one extra flake twice a day. So two extra flakes a day and now she's chubby again. So I'm gonna have to reduce that again and get her back to where she was. That's all a part of figuring it out, right? Figuring out how much she needs. And it's not slippery anymore. It's just slush. All right, you guys, we found a great spot to lunge Willow. So Stella, we're gonna revisit your woo, let me move. Yeah. I actually think this will be a little bit better in like a month. I mean in about a week. Right, so I don't know if we'll be riding at all today because uh, Stella is pretty fresh. Good girl. I don't get it. Her butt looks smaller. I need to get something to measure her. Look at she listens. She responds to words so good. So say whoa when you want her to whoa. <laughs> Does that remind you guys of storm in the summer? Oh, I was just remembering how horrible summer can be. She's like woohoo! Do you miss me at all? Do you think about the things we used to do? No, you couldn't stand tall. So why didn't you, why didn't you call? This is our hay field. I'm kind of getting depressed about how dirty and muddy and dark everything is. Like, I need some sunshine. You're scaring her with the whip. Oh. She doesn't even know what whips are. She's not scared of whips. When we came out this morning, it was so warm and nice outside. And I was like, hey, I'm gonna wash my farm coat and my farm mitts. And so I washed them and then it got freezing cold. So now I'm out here in a big, huge, heavy sweater and I'm freezing to death. And it's dark and dreary and there's mud everywhere. And the, the barn cat is peeing, spraying everywhere. And that's, it's hard for me. And yeah, it's just been a great day. 
I have a little bit of green stuff. Sophie, you're not a horse. This is what happens when you have horses at home. Your kids begin to think that they're horses. Pretty good. No flavor at all. She's getting attitude. I can tell. I can tell it now. I can tell when she's getting attitude. She's getting frustrated with Gabby because Gabby's not letting her do what she wants. And she's getting ready. She wants to run. Whoa. Good girl. It's a voice command, Mom. Yeah, she listens to whoa. Um, I'm going to take her out here like once a day in my yeah. brave yeah. for like five, five, yeah. minutes. Yeah, every day, 15 well, minutes. I have like a little treat for you, like, good girl. So many years has gone by But I think about you, about you all the time Looks like you're changing and all no. But well, why didn't you, why didn't you call? Something in the air, always something in the air Inexplicable look and feel it in the air Can you feel me? Gabby. Yeah, I didn't actually see her spook spook, but I saw your dad making a ton of noise and then she kind of started to speed up. Is that, is that what it was? Yeah. Oh look, is that her head going down? No, that's her head going down. Oh, good girl. Gabby's with Stella. They're Sam with, with Willow. Yeah. Soften. Yeah, good. Good girl. Oh, that looked pretty. Look at Willow. She's like, I've never seen that. Can I look at it? Willow's like, thank God that's not me. Yeah, she's she's just about ready, but good girl, Stella. Good girl. Short um training sessions because when she does something that you want to do, you don't push it or else she'll Yeah, stop on a good note. Back to dieting. So the tractor couldn't start? Starter's gone. Starter's gone? Did you find another no, one? No, it's for sure the starter's gone because there's tricks to get it going. And the thing won't engage to the motor. So. All I hear is blah, 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 buy a new one. <laughs> blah, 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 buy a new one. Buy a new one. 
No, he ordered one. It's coming in the mail. I'm so cold. Anyway, um, sometimes I find, like, as a parent, you guys maybe, some of you guys maybe relate that we try and hold our kids back a lot because of our own fears. That's totally me. You couldn't stand tall. So why didn't you, why didn't you call? Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.